Dame Edna Reveridge is a character created and performed by Australian comedian Barry Humphreys, famous for her lilac-coloured or wisteria hue hair and cat eye glasses or face furniture, her favourite flower, the gladiolus and her boisterous greeting, Hello, possums. As Dame Edna, Humphreys has written several books including an autobiography, My Gorgeous Life, appeared in several films, and hosted several television shows. Humphreys has regularly updated Edna, originally a drag Melbourne housewife satirising Australian suburbia. Then he caused the Edna character to adopt an increasingly outlandish wardrobe after performances in London in the 1960s through which his Edna character grew in stature and popularity. Following film appearances and an elevation to Damehood in the 1970s, the character evolved to housewife and superstar, then megastar and finally gigastar. Throughout the 1980s and 1990s Dame Edna became increasingly known and popular in North America after multiple stage and television appearances. Edna describes her chat shows as an intimate conversation between two friends, one of whom is a lot more interesting than the other. The character has been used to satirize the cult of celebrity, class snobbery, and prudishness and is often used by Humphreys to poke fun at the political leaders and fashions of the times. Her larger-than-life persona and scathing, but dead-on commentary on society and celebrity, as well as her habit of treating celebrities like ordinary people, and ordinary people like celebrities have become signatures. Although Humphreys freely states that Edna is a character he plays, Edna refers to Humphreys as her entrepreneur or manager. Humphreys and his staff of assistants and writers only refer to Edna as she and her, never mixing the character with Humphreys himself. It is this precision and richness of identity which gives Dame Edna her unique force as a character. In March 2012, Humphreys announced that the character would be retired at the end of the current stage tour. However, as of 2013 he has decided to bring her back. While Dame Edna is a fictitious character so complete is her identity as an individual, that Macmillan published My Gorgeous Life, Edna's autobiography on its non-fiction list. Humphreys has also written an unauthorized biography of his life as Edna's manager. Handling Edna, published in 2010. According to My Gorgeous Life, and statements Edna has made over the years, she was born Edna May Beasley in Wagga Wagga, New South Wales, with a sibling who would give birth to Barry Mackenzie. Everidge started her stage career in a sketch entitled Olympic Hostesses in the Review Return Fair on 19 December 1955 as Mrs. Norm Everidge, an average Australian housewife from Mooney Ponds, a suburb in Melbourne, Victoria. She spends her time visiting world leaders and jet-setting between her homes in Los Angeles, London, Sydney, Switzerland and Martha's Vineyard. She is a friend and confidant of the Queen, and has advised prime ministers and presidents. Edna once took an on-air phone call from President Ronald Reagan, to assure him that he was, indeed, still the president, and at recent stage shows the character has claimed to be giving former Australian Prime Minister, Julia Gillard, elocution lessons. The character has three adult children, Bruce, Kenny, and Valma. Her first daughter, Lois, when still an infant, went missing and was believed to have been abducted by rogue koala during a family camp out in the outback, Atil de Lara's area Chamberlain. In the handling Edna, the unauthorized biography, Humphreys absolves the koala of any role in the affair, and reveals the true fate of Lois, who in fact survived abduction, to become a Catholic nun. Edna's surviving daughter, Val Mai, has assisted Dame Edna on her recent program for ITV1 including the Dame Edna treatment, and has assisted on her live tour shows. Edna takes great pride in her two sons. Bruce, who works as an engineer in South Melbourne, and is married to Joylene from Ivanhoe, and her youngest, Kenneth, who is a fashion designer in London, and designs all of her frocks. Dame Edna refers often to him and his partner, Clifford Smale, both of whom Edna believes, are searching for Miss Wright although she admits they are looking in some very strange places. 
Kenny appeared in Sir Les Batterson's documentary A Les Batterson, and the great Chinese takeaway as a boutique owner in Hong Kong. Dame Edna's mother is incarcerated in a maximum security twilight home for the bewildered. Valma and Kenny are the only family members who have appeared on stage or screen with their mother. Her husband, Sir Norman Everidge, died in 1988 after many years in hospital suffering from prostate problems and a testicular murmur. Edna founded the non-profit Friends of the Prostate in his honor. Dame Edna was not with Norm when he died, and due to his insistence that all his organs be donated, by the time she reached his bedside Norm had been globally recycled, and all that remained was a dent in the pillow. As a result, Dame Edna almost believed that Norm's cremation was a waste of money.